Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel. We're doing a reading. How are you? Um, welcome, welcome. If you are new to this channel, okay, and sit down, relax, enjoy. But let me just share with you guys the newest drop. You can fast forward to the read if you guys want to. But this is this are wooden box for your um, little trinkets, your crystals. You know, so you put I put my amethyst. Sometimes my tarot cards I put. So this are this comes in all different forms and shape. Just like the person that you dated. Yeah, different shapes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so that's that one. But the difference of this one, this one works. The person you dated never worked. Okay. <laughs> Ouch. Okay. So let's begin over here. Oh, don't forget also for this April, I am doing your custom crystal grid. All right. The other, uh, last night I was working late because I was I was slammed with the order. Okay. There was so much people. Okay. Um, so that, and you, you custom because you, got, you, give, you give me the intention. Um, we just dropped more than 50 um, tarot and oracle cards in our website, atreadlove.me, so do check that out. I'm using the spell, okay, magical spell cards for you guys, for your manifestation. Let's see. Authenticity. This is what it is for you guys. We're starting. Who I truly am is good indeed. I am authentic in thought, word, and deed. Okay, so just, you know, just being real, just being 100, Sal, just being 100. All right, so I'm just gonna use this deck and then tarot for you guys. All right, so let's begin here for my aqua. How are we, how are we aqua? And the aqua doesn't wanna waste time. Okay, so um, let's be honest. There's someone who's moved on from you and you're a little bit upset on this. This is what I'm seeing. Um, You gave them all and then now they're basically running away aqua, okay? Yep, and you had that broken heart. You see that? Mm. And you're actually upset, very, very upset. How can you just walk away from what we have built? And then it feels like they're with someone, okay? So you're now you're trying your best to forget them and release the situation. But then you heard back from them. And then you got the blame. That listen, the reason why I'm not with you is because of you. All right, okay? Now, you call this person out that is such a lie and you always mean best for them. And then you call them out like, no, you have a problem because I gave you so many chances and opportunity, but you keep lying to me. And then now you're telling me that I didn't give it all when clearly I did. So right now you guys are in the middle of a kind of like a love hate kind of thing. Okay. Oh, and I think they slept with someone. Okay. Well, you ask. <laughs> okay. See, as an oracle, you know, don't ever ask because <laughs> I will just say it, okay? Here we go. Let's see what's going on with the tarot for you guys. Let's see. For the apple. Let's see what's going on. Here we go. The Ten of Cups. We love each other, Sal, okay? So the Ten of Cups is a lot of love, a lot of love, period. It's the strongest card, so you still love them. You hate them because of how much you love them. Because that's why you have the angel of love. Angel of love. Angel of mind. So, you guys could have been married with the Hierophant. So, that's a Taurus right there. So, there was structure. It was stable. It was good while it lasted. Yes? But, of course, there's the broken heart. So, there is a separation. Right? Okay. Now, why you guys separated? Because you got the Page of Swords. Which means that you found out that what? They were lying to you. Because why? They were horsing around. Giddy up. Mm -hmm. So, you were dealing with a stench. <laughs> It's a horse. King of Wands, the Bachelor, Bachelorette Energy. So you found out that this person was a little bit smooth with other people. And at the same time with you, with the star card. So now you look at this person it's like, I am worth more than what I am getting here. Because this is what we call your star value. Okay. So if it's a review um, from, uh, what do you call this? From Yelp, you're a five star. From Google, five star. Okay. So you are five star. And then you realize that this person was basically not being honest. King of Swords, and just like any other Aqua, you look at this with logic. I didn't, I was an emotional style. I just did what I had to do because I just want to be authentic. Yes? Mm -hmm. And I just said goodbye. The Hermit. So the Hermit is the ghosting card. So you did a Virgo, okay? So I put the effort. No, the Virgo is the effort. Virgos don't ghost. You will hear from them. You will see them. <laughs> um, so what you're telling me here is like I did everything by the book. You know, how to be a good person to be in a relationship with. I, I did it. Okay. 
That's what they're saying. With the Nine of Cups, you know, but yet they were all about their friends and casual connection. They were talking to different people. The Nine of Cups love to get attention. With the King of Wands, definitely a bachelor, bachelor energy. But then there's the Wheel of Fortune and the Star card. I think you had a, you had this kind of reading also before. Faith and destiny brings you know this person back again. So again, Aqua, we're dealing with a herpes kind of an ex. It keeps coming back. I thought we already said, let's find the cure to the exes, yeah? There should be a review. When you date, and then you get publicly posted, and then all the exes can review. Now imagine, okay, how many people, oh, one star, definitely not gonna date that. There should be, okay? I will develop such thing where, okay, so Mr. So-and-so, okay? I dated him for two years, let's just say, amazing person, but we were just too busy. And then we separate. Okay, five star. This person is a cheating mother, son of a... Mm. And then there's pictures also. There's a whole review. Verified pictures and everything. Imagine the people now would be too scared, okay, to do their dirty. Okay. I don't know where I went for that, but I'm just saying. Because okay. <laughs> the Wheel of Fortune keeps coming back. So they keep coming back. Nine of Swords, and it's a nightmare, you know. Have you ever had hair piece? I never. Okay. <laughs> But if you have, you know, any kind like this person, this is like an, you know, a soul transmitted disease, an STD. Mm -hmm. But it's a soul transmitted disease. For some reason, your person that you love, who's your soulmate, okay, keeps messing around and keeps messing up, okay, and basically keeps coming back. Seven of Cups and the Chariot. So you're telling me here, it's like, I'm just too scared that this person is going to come back and just tell me like everything is fine. Well, I'm totally confused now because I just don't want to be with them right now. Got it? So now you have the King of Pentacles. You're looking at it's like, I want someone who's like ready to settle south. I don't want this King of Wands because the King of Pentacles is ready. King of Wands is really like a go, go, go person. It's a fun, fun, fun. Well, the King of Pentacles is the marriage material. So you want someone who's ready to settle, such as the Hierophant. Mm -hmm. So now you're looking at the opportunity, Three of Wands. But this is also the person that you're dealing with. The person that you're dealing with is looking at you right now. Are you going to come back? Because they know that you're ready to check out because the chariot is here, right? And as the chariot keeps moving, you're finding yourself in a, like a house of mirror when you keep going and then only to find yourself in the same spot. Because why? Because destiny keeps bringing back the same person. Okay. We need to have a talk with the destiny. <laughs> so now you have the empress. All right. This is your value now. As your last card. So you feel like I deserve my emperor. I deserve someone who will love me, cherish me, and basically treat me okay, as an empress. So you're rising up now to, I feel like from being like dreamy with a star card. Because, you know, it's like, oh, so much we're going to be together. No, I am being more practical now. Okay? Because the empress would need to have, you know, the proof is in the pudding. Okay? So then let's see as this person tries to come back in the extended, if there's a the proof in the pudding. Link down there in the description box below. Make sure you watch your um, Divine Timing, Tarot After Dark. And also follow me on the other side and we'll continue more with some magical spell cards over here that we're using for manifestation. And we'll see what the other person is about. And together with what's the advice of the Tarot? As this person um, comes again. I'll see you guys again. Bye. Um, with the Three of Cups, I mean, the only thing they can think of you is like good times. But they worry that this whole connection right now, since you're not talking to them,